here's an odd angle you generally never see. Today we're going to talk about October 2021 fails 6 and 7 and hopefully a resolution for number 7. 6 has already been taken care of. Now I'm only going to tell you about 6 because it's nothing I can really show you at this point because like I said I already fixed it. <clears throat> Long and short of it, behind me you can see that I'm doing some China review videos. So those are rendering out. And generally with the speed of this machine, it takes approximately twice the runtime of the video itself after editing uh, to render out. So that means that a six minute video is going to take 12 minutes render time. Not long for me. I got other stuff I can do in the meantime, so it's not a big deal. Well, anyway, for each China video that I do, it's done and I run off two copies. One is uploaded to YouTube. And the second one is exactly the same video, but it's cut at the end, where generally I say, like for example, this particular one is for the Z Moon four and a half inch round LED fog lights. So I'll say, so once again, this was the Z Moon four and a half inch round LED fog lights. And then I'll continue with, if you'd like to purchase this item, that part is cut off. So right in between there, I cut it, I save that as a project, and I run that copy off. That copy I do not archive. I hang on to it because, as you know, as I release these videos, I have to get paid. So I email China and say, okay, here, here's the video I made, and I send them that video that has the end part if you'd like to purchase this on there. I cut that part off and I send them that file. Once I do that and I get paid, I delete it because I don't need to save it. For a while I was saving it and then I said, mm, do I really, really need that? Probably not. And I freed up like 80 gigabytes of space. So that was a decent amount of space that I could get back. So I did that and that's what I've been doing since. And where do I store these Amazon, I, I call it, I append the file with the name Amazon. So where do I store these? On my main machine where I have all my external drives, da, 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 da. I keep that on a flash drive. And it's worked fantastic for me. I've been doing this for years now. And it's been working fantastic for me. And just because October, the other day, which I think the video, believe it or not, was for these camera glasses when I went to upload that I do it through Gmail and it attaches it as a Google Drive link because it's way too big to just email right through in a regular email so it automatically attaches to it and comes up with a box you know uploading however many megabytes gigabytes whatever it is and that progress bar goes across, goes across, goes across, and once it's done, I hit send, and I wait for my money, and then it's deleted. So I attach the video for those glasses, and I go and do other stuff while that's uploading, because as we all know, uploading stuff takes a bit, and I had other things that I could be writing down, viewing, reading, watching videos, whatever else I do on the machine. So I went to do that, and a few minutes later, I figured, let me check back in and see how the upload is going. And it's sitting there not uploading. Okay. Something could have happened. Not unheard of. Let's cancel that. I did. I reattached it and went to go send it. It goes to upload it, and there it sits, 0%, and it's not uploading. Not giving me an error, nothing. Hmm. Okay. Gee, that's odd. File should be there because I selected it from the list. Let me go take a look at that. So I go to the flash drive. I go in the folder where it is. And sure enough, there it is right there with the right file size. I go to double click on it so it'll play it. And it said the file or directory is unreadable. Fuck you, die, and go to hell, and get Calderona while you're at it. 
Huh? The fuck? Okay, rip that flash drive out, pop her back in, have it reread everything. Exact same problem. Except now Windows comes up with that, do you want to scan and fix, which will generally scan and break? So I said, okay, something happened, this drive is corrupt. Now, I don't, I, that drive is pretty full, but there's no data on that drive that I keep that I really need. It's more of like a scratch area, if you will. Just junk files that have been sitting there that I don't really need. I said, hmm, if it happened to one, oh shit, this entire drive might be fucked and I can't get any of the data. Like I said, I don't need any of it, but I wouldn't want to lose it if I could help it, really. You know, it wouldn't be the end of the world if I did, but... Anyways, I went through the drive, and it so turns out that of everything on the drive, 100% of the drive was completely recoverable, except for that file and three or four other China videos. Those are the ones that got corrupt. <laughs> of all things that fucked up, it was just the China videos. So I essentially lost no data whatsoever. What I had to do, of course, was grab that entire folder that I had of all of the source material and the key, the project file, sent it back over here and rerun it off. So it was a six minute video, took 12 minutes to render out. Then there was a, a 10 minute video that took 20 minutes to render out. Then a four minute video, which took eight minutes to render out. So basically it killed close to an hour of my time and that was it. It wasn't the end of the world. The good news is I was able to recover all of my data with just a in, with just an inconvenience. So that was fail six, and that was actually mentioned in the one of the October fail videos this year. I can't even keep track anymore. In the prescription, and nobody reads the prescription. You have to read the prescription because that's why I'm making this video, because you lunkheads don't fucking read it. I don't write it for my health. You need to read it for yours, okay? So that's what the prescription is for. Make sure you read it or skim through it quick. I don't write novels in there, okay? It's usually just a small amount of text and it's done. And if you don't know how to read, find some of my washer videos, grab your bottle of Jergens, and you know, have a nice day. What else can I tell you? Anyway, that brings us to the next fail. Here's my oldie lamp with the clock and temperature thing on it. I can turn the lamp on. It goes on and off and does all that stuff. But um, I, the time is... And the, the temperature, and it looks like it's 21.2, maybe, for the temperature kinda and you get all sorts of weird shit going on that's just fucking great yeah um because we're not bashing his ass I guess it's safe enough to say Isaac 24 sent me a USB cable for this and it's that shitty USB cable that killed no actually I'm kidding the clock is actually run by a CR2032 battery, which I have here. I replaced that battery when I put that cable in. I don't remember when that video was, but that battery didn't last nearly even a year. This is a cheap cell, and I'm sure the one I put in there is a similarly cheap cell, or maybe wasn't even quote-unquote new. So we're going to try and replace that. And hopefully that will resolve this October fail. Okay, I want to try to not move the lamp because I don't know how uh, much slack is on the cord. So I'm going to try, oh, shouldn't say that, to tip it down. Aha! 
there we go. In fact, I got a lamp here that I'll use. Oh, well, maybe that's the next October fail. Is it unplugged? I may have left it unplugged. Um, yeah, it is. Okay, no fail, no problem. We got the big light. There. <laughs> well, thank fuck for that. I'm really happy about that. Okay, so we have to get that open, and I have 35 cents here. It looks like a dime. Mm, let's try a quarter. Better fit. Really? There we are. Oh, come on. There we are. Hmm. Lick test tastes like it's got voltage. Shit. Um, all right, well, let's stick it back in for a minute and just see if it just had an October and failed that way or if it's genuinely fucked up. Oh, look at that, it's back. That is just awesome. Take a look. Just had an October fail for no reason other than October. Holy goddamn. I can't. I can't. Obviously, I have to reset it. That goes without saying because the battery was out. So, um, yeah, that was just a minor, minor, minor wonderful thing. And now that I have this other CR2032 battery and I've taken it out of the plastic, I just have a 2032 battery to put there now. I'll need it one day, I guess. All right, that's going to do it. Back to editing videos. I did uh, five today, so finishing editing the third one and rendering that out and two more to go slowly but slowly but slowly we are getting through October anyway that was a fun one just a particular um, a peculiar pardon me clock fuck up for no reason so thanks so much for watching if you like this video make sure you click like if you didn't hit this like twice smash the subscribe button while you're at it Thanks again, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Twerp, 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 twerp,